Political number ten. So, people were made. Shush. You said you were going to be good now. Yeah, I want to be pointy. Do you want to go? Sean, do you want? Miss, can I go and get my pen out, my project file? You have plenty of time to eat. You don't have to eat it in class. No, no breakfast. Ah. Uh, Oh, Perhaps if you want to eat in class, we should give up breaks completely and just carry on working all morning. Would you rather do that if you want to eat in class? What was you going to say? Yeah. I was going to say, I'm very good at changing the subject, Sean. Sure. Centres like this have got various names in different parts of the country. They're called withdrawal units, nurture units and things like that. In this city, in Birmingham, we call them educational guidance centres, and the aim is to take kids referred by school, to send them back to school eventually, having given them time to grow up while in the company of three or four adults, two or three of whom are teachers. Newlands isn't like a borstal. It's not for people in trouble with the courts, although obviously one or two of the kids here have a slight delinquency problem. It's not a clinic. We're not fully involved with psychological services, although they are represented on our referral board. And it's certainly not just a sin bin, whatever that may mean in different parts of the country. Do you mean... Oh, Dan, 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 Dan. Kids come here for a wide variety of reasons. They may, at one extreme, be the truant who can't even face school, and we help them, possibly, to get a little bit more confident so that they can at least get in there and face I'll it. Ask Miss Hardwick. There are the troubled and the troublesome kids who've had one sort of problem or another with their teachers. This may, for example, be a, a violent temper reaction to people in authority in their schools. And they usually grow out of that sort of thing while they're here. And at the other extreme, you do have one or two people that, uh, there's no doubt, are quite disturbed and are on the verges of being maladjusted, but we would hope to keep them within the mainstream system, hope, hoping to integrate them back into the mainstream system and help the schools to cope with them.